Hello everyone, Philip Roberts here. I want to walk you through the making of my short story, Inner Peace. Started off at home. I have the camera lie down the back of my truck with it going out the little window on the back of an F-150 so you can see me taking the cover off my boat. Rolling into the next scene, I'm preparing my boat to, to, to launch it and put it in the water. I'm going to back it down, get it put in the water. The same lockdown system I had the camera sitting in the back seat locked down with some um, ratchet straps holding it in place so that it wouldn't move while I was putting the boat in taking the boat out taking the cover off and getting it ready um, I ended up with eight hours and 13 minutes of footage so I had a whole lot to go through to decide what I wanted to use for this short story Right here, if you look on the, the left side, you see the two graphs and you see the little windshield type deal. There's an actual GoPro camera right there. And I use that for some of my scenes as well. Um, I, I hook the camera up on there every time I go out of my boat. So I have footage of everything I do. I, have, I also have a uh, hook up on my four wheeler that I put it on there when I go out four wheeler as well. Um, we just try to collect uh, as much as we can all the time here I love this one. It's a different day. You can see the mist coming off the water The water's a little red in the horizon because of the Sun rising uh, The Sun's coming up over the lake Originally I had this where it was sped up like 400 times just to get that sunrise in there but then I decided to slow it down to regular speed and then even slow it down even more so that you can actually take it all in and soak it in and watch that sun rise as it's coming up and you can just relax on the water. Something I liked about making this short film is that uh, when I shot everything and I did my first rough edit, it was all silent. So then coming along, everything I added in was music and sound effects to make it sound like I was actually out there fishing and doing everything. Now here, here's a couple spots you see me fishing. Uh, the first one I was up north of the lake. Now I'm on the west end of the lake. You can see the lake's low. It's about 16 feet low right now. That's why the trees are sticking out of the water. And um, you gotta be careful where you go out there. Here I got a, a smallmouth bass. Um, Normally right there I'm fishing for crappie, but that's what I caught, so that's what we showed. Uh, here I'm just kind of like roaming around the lake a little bit, looking at my graphs, trying to find a good place to find fish so that I can put it on film. Um, funny thing is, I was out the other day and uh, caught about 15, 20 fish in less than an hour. Two of them over 19 inches, and I was just looking at my buddy and I was like, man... I wish I was still filming right now because this would be some good, good footage, but it's okay. It's the way life goes. Uh, I think everything came out good in the end. Um, I got my point across to be out there on the lake fishing, relaxing, and sometimes you got to find your, your spot to go relax and just, just wind down and uh, not think about any problems that are going on, just to relax, clear your mind. Thank you, everyone, and look forward to working with all of you in the future and seeing what we all come up with through the remainder of this class throughout graduation. Everyone have a good day.